Welcome back. It's me, Lou. I'm here for another action figure review. All right, so today we are hopping into the time machine and traveling back a whole 24 years. As we look at this, this is the 1999 Son Goku Super Saiyan Level 3 by Irwin Toys. So this figure is 24 years old. Um, as you can see, the <laughs> articulation scheme isn't really isn't really happening um, back then. <laughs> you know, we barely got any articulation with some figures. Uh, this one, um, all his arms rotate, and then his head rotates. But due to the nature of his hair, it kind of prevents um, his head from fully rotating. And over the course of time, the glue wore off, and his hair just kind of fell apart. So. <laughs> it's kind of wacky, but um, I could glue it back on, but I'm, I don't know. I'm kind of hesitant to like attaching it permanently. All right, so let's take a look at this. It's Super Saiyan Son Goku, um, level three. Uh, by this time in the story, uh, Goku is dead, which explains why he has the halo up here. Um, it's a nicely sculpted figure for this time period. As you can see, the folds are pretty well done. Uh, the paint application is nice, and his face, um, this is an issue I actually have with some of the modern figures also. Uh, the sculpting on the face is really, really soft, so you lose a lot of the facial details around the nose and mouth. Um, but for me, it's kind of forgivable. You know, at the time when I bought this 24 years ago, it's not like there was a whole... Um, variety and selection of Dragon Ball toys to buy at the time. This was kind of like at the start, um, during the late 90s when Dragon Ball finally came to Western Shores and we were getting some product. Um, it was, probably wasn't until maybe like the year 2000 that we were getting a, a, a much more larger surgeons of Dragon Ball action figures. But like in the early stages, like in the mid to late 90s, um, Dragon Ball merchandise was kind of scarce, but then at a certain point, we just got a lot, especially from Irwin Toys and Jax. Right, so it's a nice figure, and here's a comparison with a modern um, budget figure. This is a Dragon Ball Evolved figure from Bandai. Uh, this is uh, Son Goku Super Saiyan. You could buy this at your local Walmart or Target. And it's kind of nice because it's actually within the same scale. So, you know, this figure is 24 years old. This one's maybe, I think, one or two years old. And it's kind of cool that it's still within the same scale. Um, and it's interesting to see the advancements in action figure engineering with the, um, you know, much more improved and higher articulation scheme of this guy. All right. I just wanted to share this older figure with you. This is kind of like a, you know, a brief history lesson. Um, you know, back in the day, I used to collect a lot of Dragon Ball figures, and I'm kind of getting back into Dragon Ball again. So let's wrap this one up. Uh, once again, my name is Lou. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you are a returning viewer or subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. I greatly appreciate it. So until the next video, be safe, take care of yourself, buy lots of toys, and most importantly, be happy. And I'll see you at the next one. All right. Later.